Thinking peeps and welcome. It's Kathleen from Cos Creations. Welcome to the No Bra Zone number three, guys. Soon to be number four. The studio is about a week and a half away from being done. Um, putting cabinets together and that's a lot of work. <laughs> we got our cabinets from cabinets to go and to save some money. We thought, you know, We'll put them together and we'll, uh, we'll install them with a little bit of help. And uh, the first one took about an hour and a half and we've got about 20 more to go. <laughs> so this girl's a little, uh, a little tired, but uh, I was inspired. I was inspired last night from Darling Bear, Sweet Bear. I will put his... Uh, link to his YouTube channel in the description box, Bear's Den. He's a music teacher. I believe Bear is from the Philadelphia area. And uh, he is, uh, he just works so hard at everything that he does. Um, he points out the mistakes he made, which to me, I learn more from my mistakes than I do from my successes. He tries everything. He gives people shout outs. And um, I wanted to do the same for him because he's good people. And I really hope that you go over and visit his channel and give him a big bear hug from Kaz <laughs> because he's a sweetheart. But anyways, uh, Bear used my favorite color combination and he did um, a kiss pour, a kiss cloud pour. And um, I loved it. His um, cloud cells did explode and he was nervous about them taking over, but I, I still think it was absolutely uh, beautiful. So I thought to myself, you know what? I'm going to do the same because I haven't done a cloud pour in such a long time. I've got a, um, I think this is a 10 by 10 or a 12 by 12 round canvas and I have it on my little messy spinny thing just to make things a little bit easier for me. Our base coat is Artist Loft Soft Body in the black and it is mixed with 75% uh, Floetrol and 25% Liquitex pouring medium. Um, I am out of mixed pour and it seems that Darling Krista is taking a break from it. So I can't order any. So I had to thicken up my paints and I did that by using more Floetrol because Floetrol is heavier than Liquitex pouring medium. Sorry about this glare guys. I hope it'll be gone here soon. Um, our pour paints are mixed the same. Now, in order to thicken them up, I did a couple of different things. Um, this is Arteza in the Bordeaux Red, and this is thick by itself. So this was not an issue getting my Arteza thick enough for my, my ring, um, pour or my cloud pour. You can take a look at leaves a mound on a mound on a mound, as Sweet Mino would say. My gold was a little bit harder because I use golden fluid acrylics in the gold fine. But what I did was I mixed that up with my pouring medium and to thicken it up, I added a little bit of the PBO Studio acrylics and this is their iridescent precious gold. This is a heavier body paint. So I used it to thicken my paints up. The uh, Deco Art Satin Enamel I am using is in the neutral base. This was thick enough for me, so I didn't have to do anything to it. And the same with this. This is my Modern Masters and this is my Sachet Red. Oh, one of my new favorite colors, guys. Um, I buy the big jugs of the Modern Masters on Amazon. Every once in a while, I'm able to find them on sale. And when I do, I just grab them up. So what else do I have to tell you? I'm going to layer two cups right here. And then I'm going to do a kiss pour and tilt it. I might spin it, spin it but I put it on here because this is easy for me to tilt as well. A little noisy though. So I'm glad you're here guys. I'm excited about the art studio to come. We'll be teaching small intimate classes, private classes, or groups of no more than four or five. If anybody is interested, you can shoot me an email and I'll put you on my email list 
at costcreationsart at gmail.com. We are located here in Fort Myers, Florida, several hotels around for those of you who want to come down and spend a nice weekend. We'll be serving you dinner and cocktails poolside and it's going to be fun. It's going to be intimate and I'm going to teach you everything that I've learned along this girl's pouring journey. Also Seattle. Seattle's coming up in April. I'm so excited. What a marvelous lineup of 10 artists. And uh, I can't wait to get out there to hang out with my Massey boys and Canelo and Britta and Sarah Taylor and lovely um, um, Tara Lombardi from Pieces of Tara. And there are just so many wonderful artists that will be joining us there and to see my darling Billy Bean from TLP, this little piggy. So it's a good time, guys. Come on down. Classes are filling up and... Uh, we are all very, very grateful for that. So let's put some tunes on, guys. Let's get busy.
Thank you.